Hey, we back. I'm here on, well, Discord today and we're talking about stickers, specifically animated stickers. I made a video before about how to save Discord stickers because if you just right click on them, it doesn't come up. There is no save button on them. So I made a video describing how you do that, the different methods you can go about it. And I'm here to update that video because especially with regards to GIF stickers, uh, people are a little confused. Uh, the first thing I'm going to mention is that the main way that I use to save them is the Control shift i menu, at least that's what it is on Chrome. If you open it up, you get the well, this menu with your inspect element and all the rest of it at the top here, and we're looking at the sources tab. It's worth mentioning that that does not work on the Discord app. I'm pressing the button, it doesn't open up. That was removed as a feature a while ago. So that is not there anymore. We just have on Chrome or any other browser you like. You could do it on Firefox or Edge or, or whatever, right? So we're here for a start. Um, I did mention that in the old video and I pinned a comment saying it, but just in case you weren't aware, you do have to do that on browser now. Speaking of the old video, it'll be linked in the description. So what do you do once you want to save a GIF? Because the GIF stickers are a little weird. First of all, it's worth noting, they're not GIFs. They're still PNGs. I've got quite a few people saying, look, when I save it, it's still a PNG. How do I make it a GIF? Yes, it is a PNG because stickers on Discord are PNGs. All of them are PNGs. You can't have a GIF sticker. They are animated PNGs. That is a thing. But that means if you want to upload it on a server other than the one that you're on, you actually want a PNG anyway. So how do you save it? Well, you may notice we're in full screen mode for once, so I can show you my little file saving thing. And that's not like a trick or anything. We're, we're not doing anything fancy. We're gonna press save image as. It has saved the image. And now if I go to another server and I go on stickers, I can upload a sticker. Let's see if we can find the sticker. It's going to be in my downloads. And there it is. It's animated, nothing special. It's still a PNG file, as you can see here. And as Discord says here, they should be animated PNG, PNG or Lottie files, if you want to be fancy. If I uploaded that, it would be animated, as it shows in the little preview here. Nothing special about that. But what if you do want it? as a GIF instead. Well, I give you this site here. This is a site that I think I mentioned in the last video, and it will quite happily convert PNGs to GIFs. So what I'm gonna do here is I'm just gonna go and choose file. I'm gonna find that PNG once again, upload it, and there we go. We have our PNG, which again is animated. We can convert that to a GIF, and now we have a GIF. Once again, I'm just going to right click and save that image. There you go. Now it's a GIF. Now if I go over to Discord, I can paste that GIF as a GIF and it will be animated. So it depends on your use. Do you want to just be posting it to Discord? Do you want to save it, maybe use it as a profile picture? Or do you want to be using it as a sticker? You're going to need to make sure you know whether it's a PNG or a GIF. That's the main point because Discord doesn't actually support animated PNG files. If I pasted the image here as a PNG, then it would not be animated because Discord doesn't doesn't support it. I, I don't know why. It's just, it's garbage. You have to have it as a PNG for it to be a sticker, but you have to have it a GIF if you want to paste it to Discord. Also, I just realized I'm doing it again because someone complained in the last video. When I say paste, I'm just meaning like from your files, you know, just drag it in to Discord. If it was saved here as a PNG, then, you know, also worth mentioning, you can just convert between them in your Windows file system. So if I go and type PNG here, it will tell me I'm changing the file extension. It may become unusable, but don't worry, it's not going to become unusable. I can then paste that into Discord. It's not copy pasting it. I'm just putting it there. I don't know, terminology, huh? It'll look like it's animated, but then when you post it, it's not actually animated, which is kind of wacky. Um, but then if I convert it back to a GIF, again, just using the good old Windows file system, GIF, same message again, and then I can paste that into Discord, and it's animated again. Wonderful. So that's all there is to it, really. You just have to make sure you know whether it's a PNG or a GIF, because the PNGs don't actually show as animated on Discord, and the GIFs you can't upload as stickers. So you've got to pick one, unfortunately. You can't have both. Not until... Discord becomes 
a little more sensible and either start supporting APNGs or allows you to upload GIFs as stickers. I don't know. I don't think they're going to do either, unfortunately. Uh, but that's how it works. That's how it's always worked. Uh, basically, for summary, make sure you're on browser. Stickers on Discord are always PNGs. You can convert them though, no problem, using sites such as this. I will link this in the description also if you want to use it. Um, and other than that, yeah, simple stuff. Uh, you can do whatever you like with your Discord stickers from now on. Anyway, I'm going to leave this one here. Hope that cleared everything up for everyone. Hope everyone understands what's going on. If you do want any more details or any other methods, I do think I talked about a couple of different methods in the last video. I Like I say, I will link that in the description, uh, but you should be able to paste and use and upload and all the rest of it to your Discord stickers as you wish now. So, all good. Anyway, bye.